Hi folks, we've been busy researching cameras for landscape photography to help you figure out how to take the best pictures. Links to all the products in the review are in the description box below, where you'll find current pricing for your region wherever possible. The video has timestamps, so that you can jump straight to the camera that interests you the most. Now before I move on, we'd love to hear what camera you're using right now and what you think of it. Let us know in the comments. Ok, let's get into it, here are the top 5 best cameras for landscape photography. The fifth product on our list is the Nikon Z7 II. The Nikon Z7 II is a top-notch mirrorless camera that's perfect for your landscape photography. First off, the build of this camera is excellent. It features a body similar to its predecessor, the Nikon Z7. It has a comfortable grip and a flexible control layout, perfect for extended shooting sessions. Most of the buttons are multifunctional, including two of them that are assignable using the camera menu. On top, you'll find a PASM mode dial, a monochrome information display and the front and rear dials. An LCD with tilt adjustment on the camera's rear is helpful for angled shots. There's also an 8-way joystick for focus control. The Nikon Z7 II is dust and splash proof thanks to its internal sealing, perfect for shooting in harsh weather conditions. It also has IBIS or in-body image stabilisation, ensuring that your photos and video are of the best quality. The Z7 II also boasts an excellent 45 megapixel full frame sensor that can shoot 10 frames per second. It has a broader ISO range with its ISO 64 inclusion. This is great for landscape photography when you need longer exposures. You get two memory slots with the Nikon Z7 II. This is convenient for travelling or event photographers. Finally, this camera uses Nikon's SnapBridge app to wirelessly transfer your media files from your camera to your phone or tablet. This makes posting on social media that much easier. Here's something you should know before buying the Nikon Z7 II. There aren't many compatible lenses for this camera, which some users may dislike. If you're in the market for a mirrorless camera for landscape photography, the Nikon Z7 II is a great choice. The fourth product on our list is the Sony Alpha 7R4. The Sony Alpha 7R4 is a full-frame mirrorless camera with features that will take your photos to the next level. The construction of the Alpha 7R4 is reminiscent of Sony's design from the series. It boasts a comfortable hand grip along with improved internal sealing for dust and splash protection. This Sony camera has a 5-axis stabilisation system that minimises the shake in your photos. This is an excellent way to preserve the quality of your high resolution photos when shooting handheld. It's also useful for the Alpha 7 R4's multi-shot mode. The multi-shot mode can capture 4 or 16 images in a row and shifts the sensor slightly between each exposure. You can stitch these images together using Sony's desktop software. Multi-shot mode is fantastic for landscape photography as you can get additional colour fidelity apart from the higher resolution. The controls are arranged thoughtfully with the bulk on the rear surrounding the camera's display. You'll find the autofocus and menu button plus the control dial. On top of its body are three control dials. The LCD is a touch screen so you can adjust the focus point by tapping on your subject. It can also tilt up or down which is excellent for angled shots. The Sony Alpha 7 R4 also has Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity, so with Sony's Imaging Edge software you can quickly transfer images from your camera to your phone. The Alpha 7 R4 has a 60 megapixel resolution, giving you that detail-rich shot that you'll love. Here's something you should know before buying the Sony Alpha 7 R4. The file size of the photos is big because of the high resolution. If you're in the market for a reliable and high-quality landscape photography camera, the Sony Alpha 7 R4 offers a lot of bang for your buck. The third product on our list is the Nikon D850. Another excellent camera from Nikon is the D850, an incredibly versatile DSLR. It has a solid Nikon construction with a comfortable hand grip. The LCD can be tilted and is a touch screen, so you can adjust your camera's focus by tapping on your subject. The autofocus is fantastic. It has an ultra-accurate AF system with 153 focus points, 99 cross-type sensors and a dedicated autofocus processor to ensure your camera's speed. It also delivers 45.7 megapixel photo quality to achieve those crisp and detailed pictures. If you're shooting at night time, you'll love that you can set the autofocus down to minus 4 EV for low light photos. The D850 also has a low ISO of 64, giving you a greater dynamic range. 
If you value speed when shooting, you'll enjoy the X-Speed 5 processor, which allows you to shoot up to 9 frames per second. Taking photos for events or of wildlife requires efficiency and silence. You can turn on Nikon's silent photography mode to capture photos without noise. Another fun feature is the 4K time-lapse capability. You can get ultra-high definition quality to capture an excellent view. Using silent live view mode, you can also bypass the mechanical shutter and mirror movement to save your battery. If 4K quality isn't enough for you, the Nikon D850 also offers an 8K time-lapse that you can access using the interval timer. Here's something you should know before buying the Nikon D850. There is no in-body image stabilisation for video. If you're looking for a fast and versatile camera, the Nikon D850 is a solid choice. The second product on our list is the Fujifilm GFX100. The Fujifilm GFX100 is a medium format mirrorless camera for adventurous photographers. It has a fantastic build with not one but two hand grips, one on the side and the other on the bottom so that you can shoot horizontally and vertically in comfort. This design also allows the camera to remain light and thin while housing a large sensor, shutter mechanism, in-body stabilisation and two batteries. The construction of the GFX100 is solid with its magnesium alloy body. It also has internal weather sealing at 95 points, including the viewfinder. This protects it against dust, moisture and low temperatures when you're shooting outdoors. The LCD screen tilts up, down and to the right. It's also touch sensitive so that you can select the autofocus point manually. The Fujifilm GFX100 comes with a fully detachable 5.76 million dot electronic viewfinder that's helpful to frame a good shot. If you want accurate colour reproduction, Fujifilm is the way to go. It's excellent at maintaining the actual colour of your shot despite the large image resolution. You also love the leaf spring switch shutter, which responds to light touches and minimises time lag to take your shots quickly and with less effort. The Fujifilm GFX100 primary selling point is its 102 megapixel quality. This will give you incredible stills and take your landscape photography to the next level. Here's something you should know before buying the Fujifilm GFX100. The camera is expensive, but we think it's worth its hefty price tag. The Fujifilm GFX100 offers quality and ease of use, a perfect combination for landscape photography. The first product on our list is the Canon EOS R6. The Canon EOS R6 is best equipped for photography. This is a full frame mirrorless camera that will suit beginners or pros on a budget while still giving you excellent quality. It features a polycarbonate exterior and a magnesium alloy interior, giving you a solid yet lightweight camera at 1.5 pounds or 0.6 kilograms. It has a 20 megapixel dual pixel CMOS sensor which does an excellent job of accurately reproducing your subject's colour. It also helps deliver rich and detailed photos. The Canon EOS R6 boasts the Digic X processor which allows you to capture 4K resolution media while enhancing detail and reducing noise with high efficiency. You also get high speed continuous shooting. It's available at 12 frames per second with the mechanical shutter and 20 frames per second with the silent shutter. Autofocus is essential when you have a moving subject. It's not an issue with the EOS R6 and it's 1053 focus points. You also love head, eye and face tracking if you're shooting people or animals. It tracks the body, face and eyes for animals. Handheld shooting is a breeze with Canon's 5-axis in-body image stabilisation, keeping your image blur free. Finally, the Canon EOS R6 is Bluetooth and Wi-Fi compatible, so you can connect it with your devices for easy media transfer. Here's something you should know before buying the Canon EOS R6. The video quality isn't quite as good as some users would expect. If you're looking for a cost-effective landscape photography camera that provides you with high-quality photos, the Canon EOS R6 is the one. And there you have it folks, the five cameras for landscape photography that got us excited this year. If this video helped you in any way, let us know by giving it a like. And if you're new here, hitting the subscribe button. If you would like to see some more reviews from our team here at Gear Music Tech, check out this one on on-camera microphones on the left, or this one on on-camera monitors on the right. We look forward to seeing you back here on Gear Music Tech soon. Bye for now.